Welcome to Learn Data with Mark. In this video, we're going to learn how to diff the schema of Parquet files using DuckDB. So we've got our DuckDB CLI, and we're going to use the Parquet schema function to query the schema of several Parquet files that I've got locally. And if we look at the results, we can see there are three different files, and they've each got lots of columns, and they're not exactly the same, but it's not obvious what the differences are. What we're going to do now is we're going to create a temporary table for each of the schemas. So we'll have P1 schema, P2 schema, and P3 schema. And now we're going to try and write some queries that figure out the differences between these schemas. So we'll start by writing a query that finds the columns that are in schema one, but not in schema two. And so what we can see is actually name underscore first and name underscore last. Those are in the first one, but not in the second one. Now, what about if we do the reverse query? So we effectively just flip things around. So we want to find out the columns that are in P1, but not P2. And this time it's first underscore name and last underscore name. So there's been some renaming that's gone on there. So let's now cheat a bit and use a query that I put together before that brings all of this together and it gives a, and it combines both of those queries and then puts a description indicating in which file the field is missing. And so if we run that, we can see that name first and name last are in one of the schemas and first name and last name are missing in the other one. What about if we try schemas two and three? So this time we can see there's a wiki field missing in P3 and we can see there actually are some fields duplicated because they've got the same name but a different type. So player ID, date of birth and height are the ones that are in that situation. And so what we could do is we could actually write a join query across their two schemas to figure out to show like the difference between their types. So we can do a join. We'll join where the name is the same uh, between the columns, but where they've got a different type. If they've got the same type, we're not interested, then they are identical. And so again, we can see player ID, date of birth and height, and we can now see the difference much more clearly. So in the first schema, the type is int32, and in the second one, it's a byte array. Uh, and so that's the end of this video in which we've learned how to use DuckDB to compare Parquet schemas. Uh, if you found the video useful, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the channel. And if you have any ideas for new things that I should cover, please let me know uh, in the comments below. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video.